In this video, let's take a look at how to copy a mask from one layer to another. I have two photos here on my canvas. You can see the layers right here. Each photo is a different layer. Now, layer one here with this photo on the left has a circular mask on it. If I turn that off, holding shift and clicking, you can see the full photo. So what if I want this mask to just copy to this one without having to create a new mask? Well, one way we can move masks is by clicking and dragging. And so that's gonna move the mask down to this layer. But if I want to copy the mask and not remove it from the first layer, I need to hold Alt or Option, and that's gonna allow me to duplicate the mask to a different layer. You can see the double arrow as I'm duplicating that. So if I let go, now I have the mask on this layer. But the mask is in the wrong location. So how do I move that mask around? Well, just uncheck this little link icon in between the layer contents and the mask. Now with the mask selected, I can click and drag that mask over. You see, I still have the circular mask, but I can place it exactly where I want on this other photo. So that's an easy way to copy the mask over to another layer and move the mask if it's not in the right spot. Now if I show you this other document over here, I've got these same two photos layered on top of each other. So one thing we can do here is create that circular ellipse from the center out holding Option or Alt and Shift to create that circle selection. And then once we have that selection and I have this layer selected, I can come down here and press the mask icon that creates that circular mask. That's exactly what I did on the last document we were just looking at. Now, I can copy this mask over to this next layer real easily. And if those photos are on top of each other, then I don't really have to move that mask around at all. If I wanna reposition the photo, I can uncheck the link icon. I wanna show you one other option really quick, cause this is just the exact same mask on two layers that are on top of each other. What if I decide that I want to group these layers together? So I shift click both of them, grab those layers and press the folder icon down here, which creates a group. I think you can also press command or control G to group things together. So inside this group are these two layers. Did you know you can have masks on a group? So instead of having individual masks on these photos, I can actually just drag this this mask up to the group. So the group as a whole, so everything inside this group is using this mask. Now, obviously we would need to hide the top photo to be able to see the bottom photo, but if you have layers inside of a group, you can share the mask with all those layers rather than having to duplicate the mask to each individual one. And then we don't have to unlink the mask from the layer. We can actually just click on the photo layer and we could use our move tool, shortcut key is V, and we can move that mask around underneath the group, or I'm sorry, we can move the layer around underneath the group's mask. Same thing if I show this top photo, I can move it around, reposition it, and now I have these two positioned correctly in here. So that's a quick tutorial on how to duplicate masks from one layer to another and how to work with them a little bit in your document.